everyone welcome back to my channel today I'm going to share with you how to paint bougainvillea flowers and bicycles in front of the cozy house to use brown color uh, this one is a little umber uh, burnt umber mixed and I'm going to yellow a little bit so first of all try very light color source is uh, this way from this way not dry yet and try a little dark color so I'm using burnt umber this part has a shadow a little bit so after dry I'm going to uh, try shadow color a little bit and then must be here shadow too this is bond umber and I I want to mix ultramarine deep color and I recommend for you uh, brush stroke is you move very quickly like this okay maybe here shadow a little bit there and then I want to try a bougainvillea color so oh I want to take out this part uh, burnt sienna color use uh, brush and then I want to apply water clean water again here so today I want to uh, bougainvillea color pink light pink uh, bougainvillea did you ever see the uh, pink bougainvillea yeah Okay, first to try light color, very light color applies on Bougainvillea vine and yeah, whatever do you want, wherever do you want, okay, and then you need to make a little bit uh, strong uh, thick color and only don't use only the uh, same color so I want to do mix little um, this oh this one is crimson lake but uh, sorry I don't want this color so take out again and then pink John this one is bright uh, pink and I want to mix this orange uh -uh. okay so just to you try big brush okay and then I want to change brush uh, small and thin brush
you need to try before dried paper. So this one is uh, um, wet on a technique too. This paper is not dry yet. So see a little bit spread uh, water and paint color. Mm -mm. I don't want this part so I try a little bit um, dark color here I do put on the, this color and I try vine flower vine And then I want to uh, put on little lips color. Okay. Okay, next step is I want to try a uh, window. Uh oh. Window color. This is uh, ultramarine dark, and this one is in indigo. Hmm. Here, first to try. Try on dry paper. So this one is a wet on dry technique. First you try color and a uh, little bit washy brush and water into the color. Okay. Okay. This part, a little bit take out the color. Okay, and hmm, this part first apply water. I'm going to try wet on wet technique and then put on the color like that. So what do you think? A little bit different, but the result is uh, almost similar, but this part uh, applied water first this part apply paint first okay see and I'm going to a uh, little thick color make thick color and apply see Want to see a mix and orange color? Okay. I need to dig on number. and mix ultramarine a little bit want to see it now next step is uh, loof orange try orange first and change brush
I'm going to use Bonte Sienna and Magenta Mix. Magenta. This is magenta. And so I want to do uh, move brushy quickly. Two, three, four. This part I mixed the black a little bit and indigo, ultramarine, and fantasy. What do you think? This color. I loved this color. I hope you uh, like this color okay okay next step I'm going to uh, paint ground so I used a lot of uh, Bonte Sienna and Bonte Umber so the type of the brown color so I'm going to use this part blue uh, yeah, blue color. So, ultramarine and little bit indigo. I mixed this part a little bit dark. And then here is I'm not a uh, paint finish bicycle, but there are uh, shadow. Here, bicycle shadow. So I want to try first. Okay, this bicycle's shadow. Okay, and here is uh, all dried. So I'm gonna do apply uh, shadow. Okay. Paint, wine, trunk. This is, uh, I'm using a uh, Bonte Siena mixed Bonte Umber. Okay, finally, I'm going to try a uh, bicycles. Um, what do you think? What color is good? For this painting, I think I'm going to try a red bicycles. Okay, good. And flower. Here is a little small flowers here. So first, uh, I'm going to orange color flower. Really? 
this. And this is a handle. Try red color too. Here is a uh, light. There are a small window here, so I try uh, ultramarine color. I tried very light green, and I'm going to try again. It will be make a thicker and a strong color with green. Okay, brush stroke is move very quickly. It's a part of a loop, so I'm going to try very dark brown here. Uh, here is a sky part. Okay, and here is um, some tree outside there, so I'm going to try green. Uh, this one, this part, all dries. So I'm going to try another layer, wet on dry technique. So here is all dried. So I'm going to try another layer for detail flowers. Okay. Uh, oh, finally, I want to do a little bit on the ground. Apply the pinkish color. Right. Okay, uh, I'm done with this painting. So I thought many people think about the paint bicycles. It's actually very uh, difficult, but it's not as uh, difficult as you thought. It's easier than it looks. 
okay if you are failed um, paint bicycles you can try again only you have to do practice 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 is um, top of the the best method okay I hope you like it okay thank you so much bye next video bye bye